Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hey family, thank you for coming over to the channel. Uh, I'm going to be talking about Orlando and uh, how he feels about trans men and women. Okay, at first I was like, I'm kind of confused because is he bisexual, Orlando? Or he's just taking up for the uh, men and women who wants to be something other than what they were born, the body they were born in. Okay, but he gives a, a, a lot of comparisons uh, for you to think about. Well, he gets you a lot, a lot to think about. He's not really comparing. Well, he is kind of comparing um, men and women in certain situations and how some people have rights, but really everybody have rights. The gay community have rights. Women have rights. Men have rights. Um, so it's a very difficult type of uh, situation that he ponders on from time to time, I do believe. But let's see what you think about it. Y'all get in those comments uh, after the video is over. And let me know what y'all thought about what um, Orlando was speaking of on the subject of trans men and women. Okay? All right. Hold on. Want to be women, some people want to be men. The only downfall to uh, trans life is... You know, eventually you die. Shifting your organs and all that cool stuff, you know, just to look good. Just like an 80% living chance, you know. But still, we have rights as human beings, you know. And um, beauty is in the eye of all beholders, not just one. No, I feel it's just one, but this is my perspective. Trans lives have rights. Trans lives. Yeah. 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 Trans rights are human rights. There you go. Man, that's powerful. So with that being said, um, Orlando Brown, for the first time on the blue couch behind the lights, we have to say it. You are a real life street star. Yeah. Let's go. However, I didn't like that he threw up the Baphomet sign. I'm like, he's not a rock star. Um, I don't really know what kind of music I thought he was in at one time. That was not necessarily true either. So it's kind of thrown up in the air. But let's see if we can get that to play one more time for the people in the back. People want to be women. Some people want to be men. The only downfall to uh, trans life is, you know, eventually you die. Mm -hmm. Shifting your organs and all that cool stuff, you know, just to look good and just like an 80% living chance, you know. But still, we have rights as human beings, you know. And um, beauty is in the eye of all beholders, not just one. Trans lives have rights? Trans lives. Yeah. 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 Trans rights are human rights there you go man that's powerful so with that being said um Orlando Brown for the first time on the blue couch behind the lights we have to say it you 
are a real life street star. So what did y'all really think about that situation? Um, it looked like Alonda Brown fighting for everybody. And that's a good thing. That's a, good, a really good thing. But um, I got confused with his sexuality. Did y'all get confused? Because I'm thinking he's, uh, well, since he got the oosh gosh be gosh, I guess he would consider himself gay. Although I do know he has a wife or he done divorced or some sort. Uh, I, I just don't know about Orlando. We need to keep him in prayer. Uh, hopefully he'll come to some conclusion about his life, you know, whether he wants to be, you know, in, in a total fog where he's maybe trying to expose how Hollywood really get down and he's just trying to act his way through to let us know that a lot more is going on than what we uh, had suspected uh, from Hollywood elites. Because um, damn sure play a good part. I, I got to give uh, Jaguar Wright that when she said he's good. Uh, he's an actor, uh, and he's a damn good actor than what he was when he was on TV. So, as he is a part of the bringing down Hollywood type of situation, that's that's a good thing. That's a good thing because uh, we don't need people going to Hollywood thinking they're gonna fulfill their dreams, and then it turns out to be a roadblock because they want you to do stuff that's not. Uh, ethical, moral, or, you know, it's dehumanizing is what you want, or what they want you to do. And you don't want to lose your uh, manhood, not really, a womanhood, uh, just to get in the goods of being on TV, having fame, you know, having this, that, and the third. Uh, it's just too much to put on yourself. Uh, it becomes very stressful. So live your life accordingly. And make sure you subscribe, like, comment, and share. And if you're not getting my, not my notifications, make sure you um, log out and then log back in. Or sign out and then sign back on. Uh, and then hopefully that will resolve the issue. Um, but that's all I got. I ain't got no more. But I'll see y'all guys and um, ladies on the next video. Okay? Y'all be blessed. And I will see you then. Did I say subscribe to my channel? If you find yourself unsubscribed, subscribe back, okay? Don't take but a few seconds. Bye-bye.